Hi everyone, welcome back to Master Excel. Today we're going to be looking at default values when you open a new workbook. So when you open a, a brand new workbook you've got some default settings that Excel puts in, for example the default font, default font size, the number of worksheets on display here and the actual view you get. So if you click on the view tab the default is just a normal view. Um, you could change this and have when you start a new workbook this would be your default view. To change these settings click on the file tab, click on options and under the general tab you'll see when creating new workbooks this is the default settings. So if we were to change these and change the font size to 10, we'll leave it on normal view, but the number of worksheets, um, in older versions of Excel the default was 3 worksheets when you started a new workbook, you were given 3 blank worksheets. So if we change this to 5, and we'll click OK and it'll tell you, you need to start Excel restart Excel for changes to take effect so we'll go ahead and do that start a blank workbook and as you can see our default font has changed our default font size has changed it's given us five worksheets in the normal view now you might have noticed that when we change our default font our row height changed and this is a useful tip if you want to have higher rows when you open a new workbook so we'll go ahead and we'll change the default font size to 20 and we'll see what that does with our row height click OK and we're going to have to restart Excel again blank workbook and you can see the default font size is now 20 which increases our row height. So that's it for today, just a, a quick tip on how to change your default settings. I um, hope you find this useful and see you again on Master Excel.